Hello guys, good morning. So today we are going to our um, health and wellness appointment. Um, it is actually every month we are scheduled today. It's still um, a very typhoony weather but um, the clinic is open so we are going to take our chance to go there. Um, anyway, yung ulan naman pahintu-hintu siya so it should be okay. We're in between bands right um, now. So yeah, I'm going to have a facial and my lasers today, underarm, my lip, everything, <laughs> name it. But we just we get expected to get soaked when we get back home. That's why I'm wearing this outfit. Mm -hmm. It's not appropriate. <laughs> it's not appropriate for this weather, no. but it's just easy to wear something that you can just like put your arms up without really taking off your clothes it's easier for me that way it's very convenient so yeah <laughs> you might see my nipple cover <laughs> nipple cover i'm not wearing a bra <laughs> oh my gosh so yeah we're off to the clinic and um, we're taking ansa with us because she doesn't have school her school is still um suspended um yeah that's it for today it's quite gloomy talaga it's very like me but um the day the day must uh, the show must go on <laughs> it's quite gloomy but the show must and go on and as her on. song says right now if you're happy and you know it clap your hands no and if you're happy you and want? you know it stomp your feet no 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 okay 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 no one's okay, gonna daddy, say daddy no saying no singing, no singing. So it's quite traffic. Um, for places na walang electricity, um, there's no traffic light, so you just have to kind of wing it, like wait for the cars um, to pass yeah. or as like. I as I learned this morning, they don't safe. have this, they don't have the same four-way stop rule that we have in the U.S. Their rule is the larger highway, mm -mm. larger street wins. So, basically free for all. <laughs> yeah, so you really have to be careful when driving. Um, I don't think that, honestly, some of the places, their powers are not yet back. Um, we're just lucky that we still have electricity, honestly, in the house. It's been like, for other people, it's more than 24 hours that they don't have um, electricity. It's quite a nightmare already, but yeah. So thankful na may kuryente kami sa bahay, honestly. And um, if you've seen some of my reels, um, one of the biggest uh, supermarket or grocery store here, the shelves are quite empty already. People are restocking. Kasi the typhoon will, the typhoon will actually come back this Saturday as forecasted. So yeah we're good we have quite a lot of stocks in the house we will survive maybe for like more than two weeks <laughs> so we're not really um worried about that uh we always have a lot of stock foods in the freezer and even canned goods we do have that as well so we will survive for the next maybe honestly even like for more than a month we will survive <laughs> eating on rations but yeah <laughs> yeah so it's actually nice to go out because we've been stuck in the house for like how many days already this is the fourth day of the typhoon mm -hmm. so yeah we're near our um, we're near the location so I hope they're really open but I've seen in their Facebook in their web page that they are open today and the appointments for today are I uh, know are open still so I really don't want to reschedule because we might be busy for the next um, days or weeks so I really wanted to get it done Mm -hmm. 
I can see my friends are messaging <laughs> already each other. So by the way, guys, my friends are coming here for vacation. It's just too bad that it's still typhoon. We are going to pick them up tomorrow, hopefully in the airport. Their arrival is during the evening. Right. Yeah. Right, right in the middle of typhoon. Tomorrow. So I hope it's gonna challenge this guy's driving skills to drive down to the airport mm -hmm. in the middle of the typhoon if it's yeah yeah should only be a tropical storm because that's going to be the peak of the typhoon as it comes back yes. so they will arrive at I think around 6 p.m. onwards and um, they are from Philippines okay one will travel from Singapore. And then I think she will pass by in the Philippines, the, I mean the flight, and then they will meet there and they're going to travel together going here in Japan. They'll be here for like a week. So too bad that it's typhoon, sorry naman. <laughs> we, have, we have planned some activities but I'm not sure if it's gonna push through. We will try to make it happen but um we'll see if the weather permits us to do so uh, yeah i'm actually excited i'm excited that they're coming over looking forward to desiree and maricar so walang bagyo na makakapigil sa kanila <laughs> yan yung mga puno guys na tumba na Actually, madami nang natumba or nakakalbo na sila dahil sa lakas ng hangin. Lots of damage. Yeah. Right now, they're all concerned. Just get utilities back ready before we need Correct. So, guys, we're almost there. I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> so, guys, we are here now. And look at this girl. She knows where to go already. <laughs> they have actually a play area for kids, which is very convenient for us. Um, so yeah, I'm just waiting for the girl to call us and then we're off. Actually, Roy will have um, play shark too. So one by one lang kami dahil walang titingin din sa bullying it. I'm sorry, Roy. Are you having fun? <laughs> okay, you stay here. Mom's gonna sit here, okay? So, hey, what are we doing today? We're going to have... I'm going to have a facial. You too. Photo facial. And then I'm going to have all my lasers. Can I have all your hair removed? I have all my hair removed. Can I, add, can, I, can I request that you kind of keep a little bit on top to make up for my lack of hair on top? Not my hair on top, right? Yeah. My other extra hair. I'm missing all that hair, so you know. I don't like the other <laughs> extra hair. One of us have to. Sorry. Oh, you have a dragon. Oh, you're going to show mommy your dragon? Wow. What is that, Ansa? It's a furry dragon. <laughs> I think that is that Charizard from Pokemon. You have a dragon. Is it flying? It's walking now. It's walking. It's walking. Okay. The dragon's not flying. It's walking. It's a walking dragon. Does it breathe fire anything? Like mom? So we're done with our appointment, guys. The wind is so strong. Alakas na hangin. Oh my gosh. So after this, we're gonna go to the pool quickly. And see you later. Oh my gosh, you're really bad your hair. See, the other way you can tell the damage yeah. is it's not green anymore. I know. All the leaves are gone. It's brown. And it's like the trees are not dead. Yes. They've just been stripped. 
literally. That's the other big sign of a typhoon coming through. Like all these trees here have just been stripped of their leaves. So hello guys, good morning. This is the first time we go out after the typhoon. So finally, it's all over. Um, they forecasted that the typhoon has left and come back for a third time <laughs> <laughs> i hope so we've been house arrest for like one week there's just that one day that we were able to go out to buy some stuff for the house and groceries and then after that we're on a lockdown again we already had cabin fever <laughs> I miss the sun. I miss the road. <laughs> I feel normal again. Um, so, yeah. But you could see the damages that the typhoon has left us. Uh, most trees are now brown instead of green. <laughs> they have lost all their leaves. Um, yeah, today we're gonna run errands and we're gonna go to the bank. We are going to pick up the box frame that we bought for the bed. The girls are coming tomorrow, so we have quite a lot of errands to do today. That's why we're out. And yep, we're gonna buy bread. We don't have milk. We have we need to do grocery today as well. So yeah, it feels different going out again, like, oh my gosh. Ansa say hi! Quack! Ansa doesn't have a school today, still, because they don't have electricity in their school. So the school has emailed us and posted in their website that there's no school today still that's why this little girl is overdue already <laughs> she has been out and so you have been out of school for more than a week now she went monday for like an hour i know and then probably this week or by next week we have to schedule her doctor's appointment yeah, to schedule next week. Usually, guys, here for our doctor, um, Jay. Oops, isn't it? We're going this side. So here we are required to have like a milestone checkup every age. I don't know up to which age. Now that she's three years old, we have Is to do here? a. It's a yeah. For kids, um, we are required to have like um, yearly a yearly checkup for children. So yeah, so every year actually um, we have to do that. And since Anza is three years old, she just turned three. We have to schedule her doctor's appointment already. It's mandatory. So it's actually good. And she asked me the other day, oh no, that was last night. She said, Mommy, I want to go to the dentist. <laughs> I need to get my teeth checked. I know. <laughs> yeah, we haven't, we haven't really uh, brought her to the dentist yet because her teeth are perfectly clean. Honestly, I've been very thorough when it comes to cleaning her teeth. I usually brush her teeth, if not three times a day too, at least. Um, so yeah but of course we still have to bring her to the dentist soon so that they can have it checked properly checked okay let me go out guys and grab some bread i'm gonna i'm not gonna take my phone with me na. i'm gonna be quick lang so let me do this do i have yen i think i have yen Going down. Okay. What mommy gonna say? Hi. Hi. Meow. 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 What else mommy gonna say? Meow. Huh? Strawberry. Strawberry. <laughs> say. 
We're gonna buy a cake. To buy the cake. Buy the cake. Buy the cake. For buy Tita the cake. Maricar. Buy car, buy car. Because it's her birthday. My birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Three. Yes, you get your choice of the three side items, babe. So you can get french fries. I want french fries. Um, Chicken strip, coleslaw. Or what's this? Chocolate. chocolate. Maybe we can try this one. Yeah. One of the chocolate. Yeah, fries. And then chocolate. Yeah, you get three of them. So you want biscuit or the chicken strip? Chicken strip. Yes. What you doing? So guys, this evening for tonight's dinner, we are going to try KFC. This is my first time to try KFC here in Japan, and Roy told me that it's not that good. Esa na yako sa KFC sa Qatar before. Na super sarap. So I'm so excited to try and see it for myself if it's good or not. So guys, we are going to try now the KFC Japanese version. <laughs> okay, chicken is right. Oh, I'll eat the legs. This is for you. It's like thigh. Yeah, and Asa has this. Has a chicken nugget. Yeah, that's it. Let's try if it's good. Can I use my hand? Mm hmm. Okay. Mmm. 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 The chicken, the chicken. Mm hmm. Oh, you gotta try the uh, the roll. The bread. Oh, no, you didn't get the bread. You got the chocolate, huh? I no. I got the chocolate. Mmm. Yeah. Mm. That. It's a totally different crusting than I'm used to in the States, too. Oh, this one. Okay. If you want soup. Mm -hmm. You want potato? Okay. Mm -hmm. Ansa wants the stool. Yes. The Philippines. It's, not, it's, it's actually not as bad as I've had in the past. This one good. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm. So, my verdict. Guys, the KFC here in Japan is not bad. At least this brunch. I'm not sure what you've tried before, which makes you feel meh about it. But this one is not bad. Right? No. But we're talking about the taste though. How but was even, it before? But even the taste wasn't that great. I was not satisfied at all. But you ordered the same thing. Or, chicken, yeah. Or another. Like a three or four piece chicken meal, you know. Yeah. Yeah, this is not bad. I actually would have this again. 